Welcome back to Key Talk Media. This your host, Key Talk. Check it out, man. All right. You already know. I want to give a shout out to Notification Gang and Key Talk Gang, even though they're really the same thing, for rocking with me every single video. If you listen to my voice right now, go ahead and like the video and hit the bell so you get a notification every time I drop a video. Anyway, so today is a big day for Memphis, Tennessee, and specifically an artist that goes by the name of Finesse two times out of Memphis, Tennessee. He was actually sentenced to like five years in jail for a federal gun charge. He got caught with a gun. Free at last. Free at last. Thank God Almighty, I'm free at last. Finesse two times actually got released today. He hopped off a jet and was with the mob ties, you know, the ace time business. You already know. He did a whole lot of freestyles from jail, and within the freestyles from jail, they were all going viral online, and everybody was like, man, free Finesse two times. Free Finesse two times. So, of course, Finesse two times is one of the bigger street artists inside of Memphis, Tennessee. Here goes footage of him pretty much getting released out of the, you know, well, not getting released from jail, but also getting off the plane that he actually got on after he got released from jail. Anyways, so of course in hip hop, whenever people have been waiting for a rapper to get out of jail for so long, especially if they've been going viral while they're inside of jail, it's always typically a lot of fake love shown mixed in with some real love as well. But at the end of the day, it's all gonna depend on the moves that the rappers make once he's you know, once he's actually free on how successful he actually becomes. For instance, Bobby Schmurder, he got out of jail, but he didn't drop for I don't know how long his clout ran out before he can even drop his first song. Of course, a lot of people took pictures with him. They did it just to get some of his clout and get some of his juice that he got from first getting out. So you don't want to wait too long till you get out before you actually drop something. You kind of want to drop something right away because while all the eyes are on you, that's how more people are going to tune in and don't do what Bobby Schmurder's team did anyways. As far as finesse two times, like I say, he's a big figure inside of Memphis right now. Uh, I believe he's like 29, almost 30. Uh, of course, there are a lot of other younger guys that are coming up in Memphis right now. So, you know, it's not like it's going to be super easy for him at all. He's going to have to put a whole lot of work in. And it does seem like, you know, he's linked up with some of the mob ties, the J. Prince Jr. Now, I haven't heard any artists coming from them in a long time uh, that actually are popping a blue up or something like that. You know, and also, you know, I don't know what type of deal or whatever. Even if they have a deal. Yeah, better read. Yeah, federal shit. Federal like But like I said, man, we'll just have to see how that goes anyways. How do y'all think, man? What do y'all think is going to happen? Do y'all think Finesse two times going to come out with a banger? Or do y'all feel like it's a little too late? You know, five years is a long time. Or how many amount of time he was gone is a long time to be away from hip-hop. And hip-hop moves so fast that it might be a rap for him. Or do y'all think Buddy about to make some smash hits? Let me know some. Comment down below. Let me know what you think about this entire ordeal. I'm out.